All right, so just a few updates on these Motorola XPR two-way radios. So I took them to Motorola, and um, I had them updated. Well, believe it or not, like I did in a, like I said in a previous video, this one was not connected to these two right here, but that's changed. This one will now connect to these two. I had that done for free um, at Motorola, and <coughs> excuse me, they also updated the firmware to where these were more updated. Like, these are really old radios, these two right here, but technologically, they're a lot more updated. So I'll be back in just a second to show you what I mean. All right, so to go over some of the stuff that I did to um, update them, well, you can't really see what I did to update them. It's more kind of internally with the technology behind these radios. Let me go ahead and turn these on. And this one's already on. Yep, they're on. All right, so, as you can see, sometimes if you're too close to them, like that, so watch this. Whoops. Sorry about that. All right. Test, Test one, one, two, two three. three. See? This one is now connected to the rest, so they kind of all three talk to each other. So, let's do this one. Test, Test one, two, three. three. Test, Test one, two, two three. three. See? They, again, they all three kind of, you know, talk to each other. Well, they do talk to each other. Um, and there's some other things I found out, too. You actually have to have, now, don't judge me for not knowing this at first, but you have to have a license to be able to, these are for commercial purposes. And they're supposed to have licenses, meaning you have to apply for a license, a radio license, and then Motorola will sell you the software to program these with. Now, there is one um, one setting that I'm going to put on here called encryption. In case you don't know what encryption is, it's kind of like where you set a passcode, which is called an encryption key, where anybody outside of the radios that I allow to hear, if I were to talk the others the outsiders is what I like to call them would not be able to hear if that kind of makes sense and when I do it I'll do a video on that too so just a little sneak peek there encryption I found out is legal for business purposes or if you have a license and you're using them in your own private home but other than that you have to be careful because some radio offenses are punishable up to 20 years in jail and $20,000 fine which is very very bad so that is pretty much it for the updates on them. I just, the only update I can really show you now is they're all three connected. So yeah. All right, well I think that's it for the update video on these um, Motorola XPR two-way radios. Thanks for watching.